Now, your weather alert forecast. I'm 3 News Now Weather Alert Meteorologist Audra Moore with this weather update here on the web. Thanks for joining me at 3newsnow.com. We'll continue to see a couple of spotty showers across the area as we go through the rest of this evening. Rain won't be for everyone and mainly just some quick downpours. Then as we go through the overnight hours, we stay mostly cloudy. By early Saturday morning, any of that spotty activity stays a little bit farther to our east over into parts of Iowa. Temperatures for everyone in the low 70s. We do have a cold front coming through. We're still going to warm for most of us into the low, even some mid 80s ahead of that front, but also ahead of the front. We'll see some more showers and thunderstorms popping up again later in the afternoon into the early part of the evening and then continuing through parts of Saturday night. There's a chance a couple of those storms could be on the strong to severe side by about 11 o'clock. Most of that is farther off to our south and to our east. And then we're going to be mainly dry on Sunday. Could still see just a couple of showers trying to linger into the early part of Sunday morning. Again, with some of those storms could be on the strong to severe side, mainly damaging winds and large hail. That slight risk mainly just down to the south of Omaha, including Nebraska City, Falls City, Maryville, Clorinda, Atlantic. Right now, again, this will probably be a little bit more fine tuned by the time we get into Saturday afternoon. Tonight, 72 for your low, some isolated showers, breezy winds still tonight. That continues through the day on Saturday, Sunday. Again, a couple of those morning showers are possible, but overall going to be a drier day. And the temperatures are going to be cooler too. And the dew points are going to be dropping behind that cold front. So we'll see highs in the mid 70s on Sunday, 80 degrees on Monday, which is the first day of fall. Fall officially begins very, very early Monday morning. And then temperatures hang out near 80 degrees through the middle part of the week. Then we've got another front coming through on Thursday that'll drop us into the mid and upper 70s for the end of next week.